Hey guys, it's Julia and for today's video I'm going to be doing a book review and today I'm going to be reviewing Brain on Fire, My Month of Madness by Susanna Cahalan, I believe is how you say it. But this book is essentially kind of a memoir slash autobiography. It is nonfiction and it is the story of Susanna who basically she notices symptoms and things go very very wrong and the doctors don't know why and it's just about them finding out what is wrong and it is really good and it's told through like her parent like sometimes we see her parents insight or her friends insight and it's told through her perspective and it's also told through security footage when she was in the hospital that's what the story's about and I went to this knowing it was about mental illness, which it kind of is in a way, definitely, but like not exactly what I was expecting. But I like loved this. It was really good. I actually listened to this one on audiobook and I've only listened to like a handful of audiobooks. And this one was the one that I enjoyed the most out of all of them. And it was amazing. And as soon as I finished it, I wanted to restart it again and go for it again. And that's how good it was. Um, it was very emotional and like hard to like read slash listen to at times. Talking about like, um, I can't really break this up into like characters and plot and all that stuff because it is like an autobiography memoir thing. So it's kind of hard to do that, but planning on reading this book, I would highly recommend picking it up. It is very, very informative and I learned so much from reading this book and I got so much insight and it branches out more into the medical world obviously so it's very easy to understand it is adult but it's very easy to understand if you're not too comfortable with stuff like that and it's an emotional ride and it's fast paced and i almost cried like so close i was crying while i was reading it but that's because other stuff was going on but it was a very good book and i really recommend it it was so hard hitting and hard to read at times it was informative and I think it's a book that a lot of people should read and if you're like in a book club or something like that definitely recommend this for a discussion topic or something like that because it was it like you can really get a good discussion with this book for me i gave it about a 4 to 4.5 stars the which is very very high a high rating for me i never give out like this year it's been really hard for me to even give out four stars and getting closer to that five it's more of a 4.5 book and so so far it's been my highest rated book of the year which really says a lot because i'm a really strict rater kind of a harsh rater but i mean it was really really good the only reason why i deducted it 0.5 was because it was a little info dumpy at times it wasn't too bad it wasn't like unbearable but it did throw a lot of information sometimes but it wasn't like so hard to comprehend that i hated it but it was like it was there um but it was really insightful and interesting and if you guys are thinking about picking up i'd highly recommend it so yeah and that was my book review for bring on fire i hope you guys enjoyed this review let me know if you've picked it up or if you've been thinking about it or if you would like to and all that jazz down below i'd love to hear your thoughts and as per usual i will see you guys next time with a new video bye